There you go. Would, would do a heavy impression, but that would be loud, and it is still night time. Yay. Yay for playing at inopportune times. Plates, charcoal. Standing up. Pots, baskets, barrels. Meat. Nom. Salt piles. Double nom. More salt piles and legs of goat. Quadruple infinity nom. Fuck it. And even more meat and things that I didn't even notice. A bucket that I can just throw. Wait. No. Uh, I For a second I thought that this exact same bucket design was in uh, Call of Juarez. Bound in Blood. In the... In that one first mi one mission where you play as the... In the uh, where you're forced to play as the f little guy who's... I can't remember the names. The guy with the lasso, not the little guy. The younger brother, I suppose. Eggs, eggs. Uh, and you have to throw water on the building to save the guy, whoever the fuck he was. Uh, didn't much care for him. Um, didn't, generally didn't much care for any of the characters besides the main ones, because they all had the exact fucking same faces. I swear they only drew three cowboy faces and just copy-pasted one of them. The one with the sideburns onto every single cowboy there. It's just... It wasn't great. However, I did love the... Checking this again. I did love the story with the brothers. It was actually really engaging for me. And that ending... Don't want to spoil it for people who actually play video games. But it was amazing for me, really. I... <sighs> Stamina. Oh, God. <laughs> really, I... Uh, I cried. I cried when it happened. Okay. Pretty fucking cabbages, what am I doing? I should just start chewing cabbages. Cabbage. Cabbage. Sausage. Simon Honeydew of the York Pod. Um, yep, mentioning that again, great. Marcus, make something already! What's the best thing that I can devote? Leg of goat roast. Oh god. That I can devote this food to. Venison chop. Sal Salmon's dick. Like a goat roast. Ooh, honker stew. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yes. Oh yes. Oh yes. Lavender, tomato, garlic, horker meat. It didn't even take my salt piles. I didn't even know. I didn't realize. Oh god. Um, like a goat roast. Maximum healing. This also gives me stamina and stuff. And it gets rid of my fucking cabbages. Good. Twas a good day. Stealing people's things. Hello. Is there anyone around? Fuck, there is. Well, let's just quick save and try to murder you anyway. Crap, I just been detected. Boom. The chickens, presumably. Oop. No one saw me. Hello. Goodbye. Dangerous carts. Die. Okay. Sure. Fall through the floor. Lag the shit out of everything. Ooh. I can do smithing on this. Is that it's not smithing, it's tanning. Wait, wait which costs more? Pelts or leather? Ah, oh, shit, I don't know. Okay, let's check. I get 40 of the bear pelt, 40 gold worth of leather, or 8 weight as, well, weight as well, 10 for the wolf pelt. I think those are actually the prices for the pe pelts themselves, except I think the wolf pelt is 10 and weighs 1. Let's check. Yeah, 
The bear pelt, as I suspected, is 50, but it weighs... and it weighs less. Um, and the wolf pelt, which I'm also sure I have, there we go, yes, weighs 1 and values at 10, so if I'm not going to make anything out of them, I shouldn't use a tanning rack. Note made. Hello, all your chickens are dead. It's not my fault, though. Um, jeez. Look at this. Look at all of this. It's amazing. Hello, really shitty building. Oh, meat. Save. Venison. 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 Raw beef. Raw beef. People skulls. Rabbit. Rabbit. Hello. Hurt. Here for work? Get an axe and bring me all the wood you can chop. We supply Falkreath to the south. Until recently, we supplied Helgen. Mm -hmm. Falkreath trades with the surrounding holds, and without our wood, they would have trouble keeping their prices low. Very good. Do you get me guests? We have guests as often as we can, but there aren't a lot of travelers these days. The war keeps people off the roads. Mm. I haven't actually seen why it would. There hasn't been much fighting, or does that come later in the quest? The most I've seen of the war is... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. The most I've seen of the war has been... Uh, just three legionnaires escorting a prisoner. So, really, I don't see what the problem is. Walking around, Max and Relax and Murder and Cubs. Um, let's see, what can I do? Oh god, of course! <laughs> oh god. I completely forgot that I can do this now. That's beautiful. I can improve this for added value. Damage goes up like hell as well. Oh dear. Oh, but alas, I cannot. Well, I'm gonna make some leather strips now. Because I can. I'm gonna produce an iron knife out of nowhere. Very good. I'm gonna make these leather strips. Less in weight. Leather, leather strips are less in weight and more in value than the leather they are produced from. Which I find really fucking stupid. Weird. It's not very well balanced, is it? Uh, I still love it, though. For these guys. Eh, look at them. Look at how fucking scary they are. They could, like, climb all over your skin. And get into everywhere. Sorry. Okay, that's enough of that. Let's harvest a mountain flower and be on our way. Pip pip. That was a hell of a lot to harvest right next to the roads. I, I can't remember if that's something they've changed since Oblivion. I can definitely remember finding a lot more actually deeper into the woods, like in patches, but I can hardly find any here in Skyrim. Music. <sighs> What's this icon? It's the icon for a tree. Does it mean a camp? Oh, that's not a person. That is a thing. This is a person's camp, though, and this place is two. Three fucking Nernru! Three fucking Nernru right here! What? What the fuck? Three fucking Nernru! Out of nowhere. Yep, hello. Anything behind here? No. Oh crap, I forgot to log out of steam again. <laughs> oh well. De Rerum Derenes. I know this one. By Vorian Dereni. Level up, dog. Level up. The Dereni. They're vampires, and I met with some of them, I think, in Oblivion. 
Oh, and I think Cinderian is a vampire now as well. Spoilers! I don't actually know. I'm making assumptions. That's a theory. Alchemist's journal. Oh god, there was someone here. Setting up camp here near this mushroom grove. Full of fucking known root. Jesus Christ, look at all this known root. Interested in seeing what exactly is causing their enhanced growth in this area. Today I'll be heading out to see what kind of effect the mushrooms and nearby known root, known root, are having on the ecosystem downstream. Take that. Hello. Hi. Goodbye. Just going to climb into your bedroll for a moment. Ah, now I'm feeling rested and it's dark. There's a pot. I will take your salt pile. Wow. Cooking and eating salt. Shit, son, my sneak just increased. Admittedly, probably because of this guy, who is now leaving! Urgh. I'd shoot him with my arrows, but I think... I feel like there are... Balls. There are, uh... Easier to hit and more hostile targets I should be saving my arrows for. In this particular game. Texture is going across the screen on the fucking grass, pissing me off! Yelling in the middle of the night at my neighbors, pissing them off! <sighs> I wonder if I'm actually going to get a complaint about any of this. Probably will. I hope not, though, because that would be really awkward. Oh, go on. More mud crabes around there, around here. Do they even have night eye in this game? Because I've been playing for a bit and I haven't seen a single. Hello. Haha! I knew you were here. Okay. I'm just testing the attack speeds there. I've been playing for a while and I haven't seen a single night eye potion or effect uh, in my time spent here. It's getting a little strange. A little disconcerting. Maybe it's like an advanced effect. Or a rare one. Probably. I don't think I actually found many Night Eye effects in Oblivion either now, now that I think about it. Much as I actually dealt with alchemy. Obviously with cheats I saw plenty. But I guess it was mm, less of a common feature. More pheasant noises. Hopefully these ones aren't stuck in fucking trees. Nern root! Everywhere! Mud crabs! Also everywhere. You're a little mud crab. I'm gonna hit you. And then your mama over there is going to get really mad at me. Hello, mama. Cut you the fuck up. Bit of a jerk to these mud crabs. Could perceivably just leave them alone, but... Eh. Maybe they like this nerd root. Oh shit, is this a place? I guess it is. Half Moon Mill. It's the place I just was, just now. It's the place I was at. Ah, uh -huh, take that, English majors. Yeah. The place I was just at. Yeah. Yeah, post position prepositions, motherfucker. Um, mm hmm Should explain that for people who don't know. Uh, you can't... You are actually grammatically not allowed... Oh, that's a spriggan. Grammatically, you should not actually end your sentences with a preposition. I'm not sure why actually, but it, it was in a webcomic once, and I thought it was funny. And so now I remember it, because I like languages and stuff, as I may have mentioned. Wait, now I'm talking about myself. This isn't a blog, you faggot. Crap, I just realized I only have one steel dagger. Uh, I only have one steel dagger in my faves now, because one of them is special. Huh. And dagger of fatigue. Steel dagger, fine. All right. Let's see what we can do. Let's see if they stop moving for a moment. At least I have plenty of arrows. Twitchy aim, twitchy aim, twitchy aim. Stop moving. Just stand around for a second. Come on, you can do this. Shit. Oh, shit, shit, shit. What the fuck is going on? Fuck. 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 Oh, god, yes. Maybe I should have tried to...
to sneak up on them from, like, close. I mean, I should try to sneak up on them and then murder them. Talking too quietly, you probably can't hear me. Maybe I should have tried to sneak up closer. And now I should hide. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. They're gonna come. They're gonna find me now. Don't move. Summoned foxes. Holy crap. Hello. Wow, okay. Sneak master. 